Okay, Dave. First, uh, from my understanding, that Quinn's first shot threw off the mound today here at uh, Petco Park. How was that for him, and what's next for him? Well, I got a chance to uh, watch it, see it. It was really good. 20 pitches. Um, the delivery looked fluid. Um, talked to him just briefly afterwards. He felt uh, pretty good about it. Um, I'd say right now it's, it's catch play tomorrow, see how it responds, and then we'll do another uh, pen where we can start spinning the baseball a little bit. But as far as today, 20 pitches, uh, fastball command, and um, looked really good. And then how did Mookie come out of his uh, at back yesterday? He uh, hit a couple homers. I, I talked to him on my way down today and felt good coming out of it. Um, so he's going to do some more simulated stuff tomorrow. And uh, if that goes well, you know, hopefully we can activate him Thursday. But um, he, he's in a really good spot, as good as he's been in all year. So Thank, you. Yep. Thank you, Dave. Next question is from Juan Toribio. Go ahead. Hey, Dave. I guess just kind of continue the injury stuff. Uh, how's Joe Kelly doing? Is he kind of ready to join you guys soon? Joe's doing well. He's here with us uh, in San Diego. Threw well yesterday. Um, I think he's just going to come out play ca play catch. I don't know if uh, if he's taxi today or what, but uh, he he's uh, present. And if all goes well, we'll activate him tomorrow. Kind of coming in here, um, the crowd. Every time you guys play here, the crowd has been really good. Um, I think Turner last time you guys played here said he couldn't wait to play, play these guys again. Uh, do you kind of feel that out of your team that they're kind of ready to go in this series? Um, they've gotten the best of us. Uh, it's a good ball club over there. Um, we seem to bring out the best in them. But um, And I think that with that, as far as competitiveness, yeah. I mean, I, I think we'd all like to redeem ourselves and, and uh, beat these guys. Um, but again, our focus is just tonight. Um, I know that we're all excited about getting Julio back and it's going to take a, a well-played ball game by us to beat these guys. Thanks, Dave. Next question is from Fabian Ardaya. Go ahead. Hey, Dave. Uh, Andre Jackson's here. Is he also on taxi? Uh, yeah, he's here. Uh, he threw a pen today. He's, he's, tax, he's taxied and uh, you know we'll, we'll decide what we're going to do with him here in the coming days. And then, uh, I mean, just how much can you sort of speak to, like, how things are different for both these clubs? Oh, this is the last time you guys were here, obviously, two months ago, and having, uh, obviously, the sweep last time you guys were here. Um, yeah, I mean, obviously, you look at the last, call it three weeks, the win-loss, but um, to be quite honest, we've just been really concerned and, you know, ultra folks on us playing good baseball. So, um, yeah, so um, – I really don't think that the last few weeks has is going to affect tonight or the next two, you know, three games. So um, I really am not too much thinking about, you know, the last weeks. I just want to win tonight. Thanks, Dave. Yeah. Next question is from Bill Plunkett. Go ahead, Bill. Yeah, Dave, we asked you about Kershaw last week. You said you wouldn't really get excited or think too far ahead until he got off a mound. Now he's been off a mound. What is uh, what does it look like? It's yeah, hard to get sure. it. I'm I'm excited, Bill. Uh, I think we're all excited. Um, Clayton was excited to get off the mound, off the slope, and feel good. Um, I, I think that the normal progression, and again, Mark um, and the uh, medical guys know more than I do as far as the progression. But I would say in a few days he'll probably get off the mound again and spin some balls. So um, we, we as we can start using his entire mix, getting up to that 32 pitch, which is his normal bullpen session with, uh, you know, 100% um, effort. We'll start kind of getting closer. But today was a big step for, for all of us. And are you confident there's enough time that he can be stretched out to start games for you? Um, I, I, I don't know uh, to what extent, uh, Bill. I think that we still have uh, time on the schedule, but I, I don't want to, you know, put the staff or Clayton in any box. I, I just think for us each day, let's improve, let's get stronger, let's build up the arm and where that gets us, whenever that takes place, we'll just kind of see what role makes most sense. I do know that Clayton 
first and foremost wants to be healthy and he's open to whatever will help the team at that point. Thanks, Dave. Yeah.